Welcome to Alex Krulik's Magic Submitter Software. I'm David Sprague and I'll be taking you through how to set up all your items in a quick start training. And an item is simply a piece of content that you'd like to submit to a service. So if you're trying to uh, submit a video to a, a video service, your item would be a, a video. If you're trying to um, send an article to the article directories, your item would be an article. So we uh, actually use the term item is one piece of content that you'd like to submit to a service. So what I'd like to do is give you a quick overview of all the upcoming trainings because first of all what we'd like to do is introduce to you spin technology. And spin technology allows you to actually spin your content so that every single time you submit an item it is 100% unique. And search engines love 100% unique content. And then the following trainings, what we want to do is break down each individual item, explain a little bit about how to use that item or use that type of service like articles or blogs or WordPress marketing. And then we're going to go into Magic Submitter and teach you step by step how to fill each item out. So what do I mean by that? Well, let's jump into Magic Submitter right now. So I've opened a Magic Submitter and you can see right now I'm under article directories and Magic Submitter has a lot of services. I mean, it's amazing bookmarking services and blogs and RSS feeds, forum marketing with expression engine and microblogs and PDF sites. So a lot of fantastic sites that are already designed and built in. And so let's say you wanted to create a article and su submit it out. First thing you want to do is click on manage items. I just want to give you a quick overview of what each one of these is. And then what you want to do is click create or submit item. And so we want to create an item and you can see here that under an article, we have a lot of different uh, fields for you to fill out and each one of these fields allows you to put in spin syntax and so again in the next train we'll go into great detail on that but I want to at least give you an overview that each individual item you can actually manage by putting it under a project so you can create a project and let's say a project is a client so you've got client A and so this article is under client A the next article is under client A the next article might be under client B so it's a fantastic way to organize all your items and then each individual field you'll be putting in your title obviously the summary of your article and then on the right hand side here you can see all the accounts that you've already created to submit this item to so you can see here I've already created a an account under eZine articles I've already created an account under go articles article search snatch uh, ideal marketing now if I go back some of the things I don't use personally let's go under Let's go under PDF sharing sites, okay? See, I haven't created anything under PDF sharing sites, but if I create it, or I click on manage items, and I add that, you'll see that there are no uh, sites that I would actually be able to submit to. So the first thing what we're already automatically be assuming under every single one of these videos is you've already gone in and created all the accounts to submit your items to. And if you wanna learn about creating accounts, we've got lots of other videos uh, for that. So what you'll simply be doing is in these trainings I'll teach you exactly how to use PDF marketing how powerful it can be the different sites you could submit to and then how to fill each one of these out so that's what we're gonna do is we're gonna break down each individual service we're gonna train and teach you about bookmarking what those are blogs WordPress sites you know what are ELGG blogs and how do they differ from the rest of the blog so we'll go over all that so some of these sites are gonna be very familiar to you for instance most people are very familiar with article marketing and book marketing services but may not be so familiar with video services or press release sites or expression engine and using forum marketing so we'll go and dive into each one of those specifically in the next training so if you already know how to do article marketing or blog marketing you can skip right on down to the next trainings and if you'd like to know about how to use expression engine we well, can dive right into that so this is a general overview so let's jump into the next training which I'll be teaching you how do you spin technology which is used in every single one of these items so if we click on WordPress blogs you can see here I'll click on manage items I'm gonna add one and you can see again more fields to fill out that you can fill out with spin technology so that every time you submit content it's gonna be 100% unique and make sure that it sticks and gives you unbelievable link juice so that you can start ranking at the top of Google with all this great content so Let's jump in the next training. I'll see you there.